As always, thanks for watching. And if you enjoy these videos, please subscribe and click on the bell icon to turn on personalized notifications. Welcome to Greyhound's Anatomy. We've had quite a few requests about what dog bed Enzo sleeps on. And so I thought I'd do a quick video just to chat a little bit about which dog beds we have and where we got them, which I think might be quite useful for folks. So basically we decided because he sleeps 95% of the day, why not give him a comfortable place to sleep? And we've learned uh, some lessons through the different ones that we've bought. Um, but I'm hoping to share some of that with you so you don't have to make the same mistakes. Extra support uh, overstuffed bed. It's a round one like this. Um, and it has these nice little grippy bits at the bottom. Uh, it has a zip-off cover, which is great. It's 100% polyester, um, but it is pretty durable. It's got this sort of um, slightly softer top to it. Um, and this is the first one that we actually got him. There's a sort of cushion material inside. Um, and we found that he uh, kind of curled up on it and then now just decides to lay all over it with a head or a leg or whatever it is off either side. Um, what has been great about this bed is because it's the first bed that he got, he seems to love it the most, which is bizarre because the other beds we bought are far more expensive and far better than this, uh, basically just a cushion. Um, he got it on PetSmart. Um, they don't currently sell the same bed anymore, but they do sell a similar bed, but now it comes with these fake full, full fur, fake fur, uh, looks like 70s shag fur carpet, uh, if that's your thing. Um, but yeah, the bed is, is pretty much the same. It is around um, 39 inches wide uh, and it's about five inches high. Or it might've been higher before, but he's um, squished it quite a lot over the years. It's kept its form somewhat, um, but yeah, it's definitely nearing, I think, the last year uh, of its life. Although if he has his way, he'll keep this thing till uh, it literally rips apart. actually bought him. It's the Furhaven Comfy Cool. Uh, it's at a jumbo size here. It's 44 by 35 and I'd say about five to six inches high. Um, it's pretty standard sort of foam inner. You can unzip the cover as you can see here um, and then there's a sort of a softer uh, polyester. The foam is actually quite nice because it's got dimples so I assume that it massages him. Um, but this was yeah kind of getting a little thin over time. It's one of his favorites, if not uh, probably the second favorite mattress. Um, we keep it in the, the, the TV room, so he spends a lot of time here. And as you can see, it has started to wear somewhat. We bought it um, off of Chewy, uh, which I think about eight months ago, um, it was around $80. And I think the price is still pretty similar now. It's held up okay. It's probably seen the most wear and tear, but he is the roughest with this one. Uh, you can see there's some little tearing happening over here where he um, gets the zoomies and sort of pushes it around the house. It's also done a similar thing over here on the back. So yeah, hasn't held up incredibly well, but uh, overall, okay. It is starting to also just sort of lean over here on this side, the arms where his head just hangs off the side. But it's a really nice size for a greyhound. He gets his whole body in here and then his head just lies off the edge here. So he really likes that. Overall, it's great. It's definitely the one that we've seen the most interest from when we do post videos. So this has been a huge favorite and we've seen a lot of other ground owners with these beds. So uh, it's it's a goodie. It is starting to, as I said, feel a little soft and a little thin over the, the, the thinner part of the mattress. Uh, so as a quality piece, I'm not really super impressed, but overall though, um, yeah, I'd give it a solid six. Um, Enzo really enjoys it, so he'd probably give it an eight. Um, overall, I think just that the quality could be a little bit better, um, but it is a great large bed um, and one that, that is definitely worth it if you're not, uh, if you don't want the massive one like the Kirkland one, which does take up a lot more space. This is a great kind of intermediate space um, for, for the ground. So 
know, the most recent bed we bought was from Costco. We actually saw quite a few reviews about these beds and quite a few um, other Greyhounds that had these Costco beds. So um, as usual, walking through Costco, buying things that I definitely don't need. Um, I saw this bed, it was very reasonably priced, again at $59 uh, before tax. Uh, and I thought, why not? Again, because he sleeps so much. Um, it is a very large bed. Um, this is kind of the size, you can't see the, the full size, but it is 32 by 42 inches. Um, and it weighs around 10 pounds. So it is a very heavy bed. Um, but what is quite nice is that it has a sort of inner mattress, which is really cool. Uh, we use a similar one for the back of the car, so when we take him out to restaurants or when we take him to, um, with us to bars or to the breweries, um, then he sleeps on this. Um, so it's really nice because this one actually has um, a handle here, um, so you can carry it around, uh, which is very useful. And then he lays a little deeper in the bed when this is out. Um, he does enjoy this bed. Yeah, not his favorite bed. But it is my favorite, it looks cool, it's got this nice hound tooth pattern, um, and I mean, gosh, it's so comfortable, like I would sleep in this thing. And I haven't seen an exact replica available on Costco, but all the Costco um, original Kirkland beds are actually similar in look, but now it seems like they have a different material. Um, yeah, and again, definitely worth the, uh, the purchase because I find they've been holding up really, really well over time. Um, We've also been able to wash the covers. You can zip off the covers uh, and, and wash it. It is made out of polyester again, um, and then polyurethane foam in the middle. Um, but yeah, pretty good bed, and it looks looks good. So definitely one that's worth it if you have a much bigger Greyhound because he, uh, he is dwarfed by this bed. It is massive. I'll be putting some links in the description below for you to see and click out uh, to if you want to buy any of the mattresses. Um, so have a look in the description um, and the links to the various uh, mattresses will be there below.